statuses for the CVs. If the CV status is available, then this means that the CV was just added by the external office and it is available to create an employment request with. If the CV status is processing, then this means that there is already an employment request um, created for this candidate so that the other, external, the other Saudi offices cannot select this candidate for employment. If uh, the, the candidate status is turned to employee, then this means that all the contract parties, the four parties, which is the Saudi employer, the Saudi office, the candidate, and the external office, which is the Pakistani office, have approved uh, on the employment request, and uh, that no any other Saudi office can have and select this candidate for employment. So this means that this CV is already turned to employee and is coming to Saudi Arabia. As we see here in the footer, there are separate, uh, there are uh, several pages under the HR poll. User can switch between the pages through the pagination by clicking on the desired page. And he can navigate through the HR pool pages easily by clicking user can also filter the candidate according to the uh, to the status of the candidate for example if user only wants to view the available candidate he could do so by clicking on the available status also user can search for more than one status by clicking all the desired statuses in order to have a customized list of the candidates. User can also filter the HR poll page through sorting the candidates based on date, either newest or oldest, or by sorting the names, either ascending or descending order. User can also search for specific candidates by specifying the desired job or the desired skill. User can select more than one skill to search for. User can also search for candidates by specifying the qualification of the desired candidate and by entering the range of age. For example, if I want to search for candidates aging from 20 to 30, I can do so by specify, uh, specifying the range and clicking on check so that the list would be filtered based on my selection. I can easily unselect the filters by clicking on the X icon. User can also search for candidates by selecting a specific gender, a specific religion, or by searching for the creation date from a specific date to a specific date, or by directly enter any keyword that is available on the candidate details. For example, I can search for candidates by specifying the, the passport number, and the list would be customized based on my search results. We will move to the next page, which is employment requests. So after the Saudi office and the external office uh, have had a partnership contract agreement and the external office um, has uploaded list of CVs for the candidates, then now the external office would receive employment requests coming from the Saudi office for a specific Saudi employer and a specific Pakistani candidate to process the employment procedure with. 